Hello, everybody. This is Pastor Phil with Full of Life Ministries. Today's message is entitled Blind Guides. St. Matthew chapter 15, verse 14 tells us it says, Leave them alone. They are blind guides. And if the blind guide the blind, both will fall into a pit. The definition of a blind guide is a person who exhibits a lack of understanding about what is true. An individual who's looking for solutions to their dilemma is getting advice and help from another person who acts the part of a guide or counselor, but their ignorance to the truth is all too evident. And some of these blind guides are very pious, self-centered groups of hypocrites, typically focused on power and political persuasion or influence over the spiritual health and well-being of God's people. And they're always quick to call out the sin of others but mindless of the filth that festers deep within their own hearts. So in short, they just don't get it. They don't understand the heart of God. And this can lead you into a dangerous place, causing you much harm. Proverbs 11 and 14 says, where there is no guidance, a people falls. But in an abundance of counselors, there is safety. Operating with a clear head enables you to make good decisions. But when you compromise your safe space, you will struggle through life, always finding yourself constantly feeling bruised because of poor choices, feeling neglected and often regretting the mistakes that you made. But wise counselors will provide sound advice and their words can direct you on a clear path. Yes, you may be blind, uninformed, or misinformed about various aspects of life, but why take advice from a source that has proven to be unreliable. People of God, the safest place in the whole wide world is with the one who keeps you away from the danger zones that can cause great pain and trouble. My advice to you is this, on today or tonight, leave those blind guides alone and be counseled by Jesus. Today, I want you to be encouraged and I want you to continue to keep shining. And thank you once again for tuning in to Full of Life Ministries. God bless you.